Hi everybody, I'm Carol with Free Spirit Arts and I'm back. Turning on my lights. My husband just ran out. It is blowing and raining and cold. And he just said, I'm going to run and go do this errand and do that errand. Is there anything you want? I said, yes, chocolate. I need some chocolate. So I ran upstairs and said, I'm going to work on my book. I've done some things. I don't really think I made this with you. So um, there's that. And I put in a Velcro little latch. I actually wanted to put in a snap, but it was a not happener because the snaps would not go through the paper and it tore a big hole here. So I decided a Velcro closure would probably work fine. <clears throat> I left some room because we're going to put some stuff in there. Let's see, I did a couple things. I think I did this with you, so it's dry. Put that on. I want to do this. I cut this out. I went to Etsy and printed off, and I bought this palmistry um, digital, and I'm just picking through it basically and and deciding what I want and what I don't want. This isn't an educational book, so I just want things that um, she can relate to that are fun. And this hand seemed appropriate. These turned out to work great. I did go through and sew these on the sewing machine. And I think I'll put a little gem on either side because you know, that's kind of jemmy and it'll fit fine. And I, is there, let me see if there's anything else I did. I had to patch that hole. I did this with you guys. No, I think that's it. So we need some more, it needs bling, um, but she's coming along. Okay, I want to put, I've decided that I'm not going to put any more bulk on here. So there's not going to be any surprise flips or anything. So let's go ahead and put this on. And I decided it was going to be, this was going to go here, right? And I do have a little piece of lace I can put. Yeah, that, that's just going to be great. So I'll put the lace maybe just like barely on the edge. I could put it on the inside here just to break that up. Maybe I'll do both. Just, just, you know, a little bit. Tammy, you got your package. I love it. Love that you love it. You know what? I put these together. I take, took about a week per kit. I let them sit and, and I walked around and, you know, some things I did buy, but not much, and then um, I'd put it together, and I had fun um, putting them together. I had a lot of fun. They were really enjoyable. So I'm, I, you know, when you open them, it's been a while for me, so I was kind of like, oh yeah, I sent that, oh yeah. We're doing grungy, but we're not really doing shabby, so got to be careful. I can't get it too frilly. Oh, this is where I need my button. I 
I'm so glad I thought of that. So, let's see. It's going to have to go... I think I decided it was going to have to go like right here. So, I don't want two faces on the same area, so I don't want to use that. I wonder if I should wipe that glue off. Maybe I should. I think I will. Sounds like Hubby's home already. Wow. It's, it's just pouring out there. Pouring. Yeah. Well, that just made it worse, but I'm glad I remembered I have to put this This would be nice. So if I put this here, my button pretty much, it has to go about right there to close this off. It has to go about right there. That would fit. So if I put the other one about right here, I just don't know if I need that bigger one. They're just not that, huh. I love them both, so. Let's see what they look like next to each other. It just looks like too much to me. <clears throat> this looks like Silence of the Lambs now. That's a no-go. Mm, that's pretty. Or I could say to heck with that and just make this one of those tucks. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. So we're going to change, change our other mind. So let's make this a little tuck like right here, just barely, so you just like that, yeah. And it would be the one that I don't have a hole in. Let's get a hole in there. And let's get an eyelet. Well, I could use this. I love this. Let's just see. Let go. Yeah, I really like that. Okay, so let's do this. So, right there. And if I had a pen or a pencil or something, Let's make sure again. Okay. <clears throat> We're just going to have to do it. whining to my husband about how concerned I am about our dog and how mad I am at the coyote and we need to do something and he said well we haven't seen the coyote for two days maybe Jaja kicked his butt now he's gone and that's where she got it maybe she's not the victim I'm like oh well you go girl <laughs> put a whole new spin on it for me. I was like, well, yeah, maybe so. And is that going to work? That is awful stiff. Boom. 
before I glue a back on here, I'm gonna make sure it works because I layered these up. I put like four pieces per button because I was thinking they were gonna, you know, really have a job to do. So if this goes here. Oh yeah, that'll barely catch. Good job. Okay, we're we're doing this now. Where's my other piece of lace? Here it is. Oh, maybe I should have a tab. Let's do a tab. You know how I love a good tab. He just slammed a door. He must have kicked it with his foot. He must have an arm full of something. Yeah, Tammy, I'm loving your ideas. I'm glad you weren't too overwhelmed. I did post on your channel yes that pretty green cellophane do you know what that is that's actually floral wrapping or well not well maybe i don't know it's um the stuff they put around a pot you know when when you go to the florist and you get a pot i just couldn't throw it away I'm like that is gorgeous and I know how you, you're a metal girl. You love the coppers and the, <clears throat> so, and I knew you hadn't done a steampunk, but I thought, you know, I bet you could put your spin on one and really make it cool. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't have to punch a hole in this one. In this top piece. I'm really glad about that. Now this one, I do want to put this. So, where is this part? Oh, sorry guys, the glue's got to me. So I just want, hmm, I don't think this is long enough. So maybe I need a slit. I think maybe I need a slit. This can't go past here. Then it would need to. The slit would need to be about right here. Okay. Let's get a sharp cutting tool. Maybe this. I don't remember how sharp this is. Oh yeah, this is the one I never can figure out how to get into it. Okay. I don't, I don't trust that. I need something harder to. Cut into. Oh. Did 
Where's my mark? There it is. So if I go Well, we know one thing for sure. This is really tough paper now. Okay. Now I'm going to take this. And I'm just going to barely, just barely cut. Where's my, where are you? Perfect. Okay. And it should be lighter underneath that slit so you can see it. Let's see, yeah. But let's darken it up though. Okay, now I can glue it all the way around. I forgot to put my bottle, close my bottle. I do recommend if you're going to seal your papers with something like a stain glue, I highly recommend that you use acetone to glue anything onto it because it doesn't want to stick to uh, regular paper glue because it's not really regular paper anymore. It was, but once you seal it, it's more like vinyl. I sure love the way it feels though. It's really cool. It's a really neat feeling. I like the feel of the plain paper, but I think I'm getting a spam call. We're supposed to have a contractor stopping by, but This is crooked. I don't like it. There you go. There you go. Thanks everybody for commenting. It's really been encouraging. You know, it can be intimidating to um, put yourself out there and think of a new idea and all that. I'm not easily intimidated, but I, just, I love what I'm doing, so I think that's the difference. And I really can appreciate the creators who just, you know, they're not following necessarily all of the typical rules and they're kind of going their own way and I love those so I know 
when I do those kinds of things, there's probably other people out there who say, oh yeah, that's a great idea. Or, nah, I don't think I would have done that, you know? I think that's what it's all about. Because I don't, there's people that I watch all the time that I'm like, oh, I would have totally done that different. But I still, as a creator, I just still enjoy watching them and I think they're talented and everything. But it's fun to see, you know, they do one thing and I think, oh, I think I would have done it differently. I know it's not water soluble, but it helps me just to get it moving. Okay, I like that. And I will put her name on there at some point. Okay, that's down there. And I got a tab. Yay. And it latches. Bam. Not going to worry about putting anything in there just yet. Let's close this one. I went downstairs a bit ago and it was just blizzarding rain, sleety, sideways, cold, howling wind. All the windows are just soaking wet with, looks like it's kind of trying to, what, 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 what? Oh, let's put all this. This is that coffee, I coffee dyed it and it, I couldn't get it dry. I actually took the heat tool to it and just about burned it, which made it even prettier. Yeah, I went downstairs and saw all the yuck going on outside and just, I just took a minute, looked outside and said, I am so grateful. I just felt grateful. I just, I felt grateful to have a warm house. Grateful to be retired. Grateful that my cupboards are full. You know? I don't have to go anywhere. Yeah, just, that's just the amount I need. Just a tiny bit on the edge. That's all I wanted. Not gonna put anything under this one. Plenty, plenty of room to bend. Just giving that tacky glue a minute to find its way. Making sure I don't have a bunch of loose glue. There is a little bit. Now this one is going to be a little different. We've got this pocket to contend with. So I really do need one of those little circle things and this is plain enough I can absolutely do it and because of the math I think this would look great. So let's get this part on. Why does that not look 
dark enough. You really don't need that much glue, not when you're using Fabri-Tac. Oh, no you don't. Don't even. Do I want a tab? If you want one, you better get it in there now. Hurry, hurry. Let's, let's do it like this. You better make up your mind, girl. Okay, now let's cut. I might have just boo booed this up. Let's see if I can change it. Okay, now let's put some glue on here. And I'm all about the grunge, about the grunge. a lot of pressure to get that to stick because it's got quite the depth to it. I may go over that with sewing machine. I like that little tab though. That is cool. All right. I like it. I like it. Do I have a clamp? I think I put the clamps back. I'm mumbling, guys. Sorry. I'm thinking about stuff. Okay. Come here, you. Tammy, that uh, you were talking today about would it pop, is there is it feasible to make those astrology personalized astrology journals because they're so time consuming. You know what you'd have to charge. I think that's a hundred and fifty dollar journal, and I think people would pay it. I think I probably would if I was looking, if I were looking for a gift and I wanted something really personalized and you had a way, you know, marketing, I, I absolutely believe that you could sell them. That's my opinion. Okay, so I was thinking about this one, wasn't I? Was I? Was that it? Right? Oh, get a sneeze. Hold on. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> 